Hey everybody, this is Ian Thornley. This is Brian Doherty. We're from Big Rec, you're watching Shockwave TV. So, what I really dig about you guys is basically, you know, out of all three Big Rec albums, two Thornley albums, there's always, there's a consistency to the sound, but there's always change and evolution that happens in the songwriting here. I mean, the Thornley stuff had a little bit heavier of an edge to it. It's only um, the first record. Yeah. yeah. That was yeah. it. That was it. Yeah. But I like, with Albatross, it seems that you kind of took all that stuff in maybe, I guess, the time experience. You, you know what? Like all of that, a lot of it's conscious and a lot of it's not, you know. Yeah. I mean, I always say this, but whenever you set out to make an album, you have a, you have a picture in your head of what you're going to do. And then it takes on a life of its own. You know? It's almost easier to say, like, here's what I'm not going to do. Right. You know? And what are the, like, little, silly little guidelines? We're not using big guitars, man. We're not using big, you know, Marshalls and all that. Of course, we end up sort of coloring and sparingly sort of seasoning the music with Of course, it needs a bit of a big guitar sound. But for, for the most part, it was all small amps. And I think that'll lend itself to the sound being different. You play differently, you know? As opposed to conversely, the, the, the Come Again record was yeah. like, I don't think we, I think we used a, we used a Bernie on it. We used one combo for like an overdub. Yeah. And it was like eight half stacks <laughs> going, all separated, going at the same time. Nice. And we could bring in a different, you know, it's ridiculously thick. Nice. Um, but yeah, I, I, you know, I like to, growing or just seeing what you can get away with. Yeah. You know? Yeah. I think it's, maybe that's what growing is. I don't know. I was thinking about this was last night or the night before. I said, how much you can get away with? I said, was it like stuff I was telling you I'm working on at home? It's like, well, could this be a, this kind of song or that kind of song? Right. And can I sing the word baby? <laughs> right? No. Can you see what I'm saying? Conviction. That's, that's the thing. Yeah. Like, Not again. Yeah. Bono does it, and you're like, yeah, it's pretty you did, yeah. And then I saw an interview with Dan Lanois, and he was like, yeah, Bono was wondering, like, can I get away with singing baby, baby, baby? And I'm like, fucking hey, man. He wonders the same shit. Like, this Bono we're talking about. Yeah. With Mr. Shades. Like, this yeah. is the guy. Yeah. And, I, you know, I think that's part of just sort of. There's, a, there's an element, an aspect of seeing what you can get away with. Yeah. You know? Yep. Uh, I think you know, a lot of the stuff on, on this album it was like that. Like certain songs, Glass Room, for instance, a very sort of, to me, it's an early Tom Petty vibe to yeah. it. Um, That's probably my favorite song on the album. Thanks, the man. I, really? It's one of the yeah. ones I keep going back to as well. I think it's going to be released as a single in Canada. That's nice. Th those are the moves. Uh, but anyway, that, that, something like that was, a, you know. We would never have dreamed of that on the yeah. first record. There's no way, man. Cowboy Court? Seriously? Yeah. <laughs> Come on now. Uh, and for some reason, it's maybe because we've been away from those kind of things for so long, and going back to them, and, you know. It's, oh, yeah. And it's okay for when the chorus comes. We're not going to use big, massive marshes. What can we use? Yeah, Acoustic 12 things. strings. Yeah. Boom. <laughs> that opens it up. That's a, that's a petty trick, you know. Nice. Like just, oh. Nice tight drum sounds and clean guitars sound huge. Yeah. Well, it's, it's funny you mentioned the Nofler thing too because Control is there oh, in, that, in that range, yeah. man. It's it's a great song. Yeah, I like. I that. it. That's sort of like that one actually started. I've been asked about that, and, and of course his name comes up. Yeah. I to, rightfully so. But that song started out in my mind as a Peter Gabriel riff nice. because the chorus. I think sort of the, just the changes in the and the melody sort of I'm like okay what, what would what would Peter do you know nice. and then I started so I tried all these he shocked the monkey <laughs> <laughs> shocked my monkey um, I tried all these different treatments to, to sort of go down that path and they didn't work and then it was like I think it was just a strat in my hand and I was like well what if we did like the desert you know desert drive at night the top down kind of vibe. Uh, and then, you know, just started offering out a little bit, and before you know it, it's, and then just, it was that quite, that, that simple, actually, so. But yeah, it's a total, it's a total wreck. Nice. Well, the album's killer, man. I'm stoked to see the show, and, uh, you know, I hope you guys are going to have a great tour. Yeah, man. And, oh, uh, tomorrow we'll be doing five. We're here for a couple weeks, we've got a Canadian yeah. thing, and then we'll be back. We've got nice. some summer group. festival stuff coming nice. up, so. <laughs> we'll be back pretty soon. Is the, is the album 
selling well in the States? Or? I don't know. That's a great I way to look at it. <laughs> I don't. I it makes things a lot easier. I don't think anybody it? sells. I mean, I think Justin yeah. Timberlake might sell records, but for the most part, I don't think anybody does anymore. I don't know, and I, you know, I should be more aggressive than shit, but I'm really, I don't care. Yeah, if I can make a living, then I'm, I'm, I'm happy. Anyway, I don't want to be the next. <laughs> Justin <laughs> Biebs. <laughs> well, Actually, I, I would like to be the next Justin Bieber. I definitely appreciate the time. Looking forward yeah. to see the show. Yeah, man. Um, catch you next time. You guys come back. Right. Right. Good to meet you. Yes, ma'am. Take care.